Welcome to Matt and Foil. And welcome to another review, uh, this time from vacation in Spain. And it's not going to be a dock review because there are no docks, but it's a rock review. And it's quite special because last time I was on vacation here, I thought, well, it's going to be easy. It's going to be a rock and just start from there underneath. It's going to be sand. So perfect. But it's not like that. So we have about 40, 50 centimeters of shallow water. So there's super sharp rock underneath. As you can see, I'm walking there and uh, cutting my feet. And uh, at the end of this rock, it actually drops, drops about a meter underneath is sand. Here you see that border and uh, I thought to start from there but it's not possible for me it cannot jump that high so I saw some of you buying a ladder or maybe uh, buy a chair like Ludo Freefoiler but uh, it's no option for me I don't want to buy something and leave it there so I started to push around some rocks like in the end of fall and uh, it was actually quite fun but also a bit scary I was uh, scared that the rock would fall on my foot now once I did it, I started to start from there, but it was super wobbly. And when you start pushing uh, to go on your board, everything wobbles. So that's pretty scary. Anyway, I wanted to start and I did. And uh, it was quite difficult, but I want to just show you. So here are six seconds of fails. So once that didn't work, I got another big rock and I uh, finished my rock to start from. Still wobbles a bit, but it's possible to start. And after two or three more starts, I figured it out. And I can say this rock actually works. Even if there are waves, you can start from there. It was the first time for me, uh, pump falling in salt water and uh, you have more lift. So the front wing is too big. I need to be much more to the front of the board and it's the 80 centimeter board, which actually it's possible that it's too short. If you're a uh, pump falling in salt water with my weight, my little toes are just hanging over the board. When coming back, you actually uh, can glide on the waves, but you have to take care not to breach like I did here because the water is so clear, you cannot really see when you're out of the water. So I didn't get bloody hands just for me. You can go and find this rock too. It's south of Barcelona, south of Tarragona in La Mella de Mar, and actually not just in La Mella de Mar, but in Las Tres Calas. And there's a Torrente del Pi, the name of the beach. Here you can see how it looks around there. There are a lot of rocks. Maybe you can find one where you can rock start, but I highly suggest some shoes of some sort because the rocks are super pointy. Other than that, I mean, it's Spain, it's the water is warm. There's not much seaweed, it's just beautiful. That was it. If you wanna find other docks or rocks to start from, check out my playlist. If you have another dock I should visit around this area, La Maya de Mar, the Ebro Delta, tell me so in the comments. If not, I'm happy to get your like and see you in the next one.